Floyd's afraid of a fight. Floyd doesn't want a fight. Floyd wants a boxing match. And I've already said, no problem. Get my fucking money. And when you get my money, then we can box in this boxing match under these set of specific rules that will keep you alive. So, I'm here. Where's my money? Because if you keep dropping my name and you haven't got the money, then I'm going to show up at your front door. So, we'll see. But Floyd does not want a fight. Floyd wants a, a match under a specific set of rules. I don't need rules. So, I'm open. Let's see what happens. Right now, it's just talk. Eero Jackson says, Is it true you think the current WWE roster is a bit shit? Um, yeah. That's simple. <laughs> yeah. Good answer. <laughs> yeah, well, what do you want me to say? The dweebs, the whole lot of them. You can ever go into wrestling? Maybe as CEO. You know what I mean? Maybe just take Vince out of the chair. But I don't know. Brian Brady asks, you couldn't commit to the Triple X sequel with in preparation for an eight year rematch. But would you ever would you reconsider going to Hollywood acting? We'll see. I'm not gonna never say never. Never say never, so we'll see what happens. Right now, fight business. There's the fight business and then the show business. Show business wants me just as much as the fight business. So, we'll see. Maybe I'll leverage them and see where we go. Hannah Byrne says, Mystic Mac, can you predict, give us a prediction for 2017? Who you'll be fighting and where you'll be fighting? You know, I can, but it's, it's, it will blow. The whole game is going to be set alight. The world is going to explode inside that octagon when I have them two belts wrapped around my shoulder in Madison Square Garden. So all I'll say is, stay tuned. Jack Kind asks, what's your message to Eddie Alvarez? I have no message. It's over. They know it's over too. They're apologetic. They said this, they said that, they said everything. Now it's, he's the best striker I've ever seen. We apologise, I apologise. It's, show up, take your ass whooping, and I'll see you, I'll see you later. That's it guys, thanks for the questions. Comment, Thank you, thanks, for signing. thanks so much. Sam Greenwood wants to know if a Nate Diaz trilogy fight will ever happen. Yeah, I think, I think potentially so. I, I, the more I think about it, Nate is going to be... Uh, there was a lot of damage done to Nathan in that last fight. Um, even looking at his facial features, they, uh, they are not the same. So I know I know those close to him will, will, will understand what I'm talking about. So There could be a, a, a potential fight maybe down the line for the lightweight belt after I win this. But to see him have to make the weight and then to see the damage that he took in the last fight and then come in on a, on a much lower... Uh, at a much lower weight it wouldn't end good from, for him so uh, I'd imagine and I'd probably hope that his people close to him would stop him from doing it it's done now cash your money and bounce but if I call him I call him and we'll see what happens Alex Thompson asks will a fight between you and Floyd Mayberg ever happen? <laughs> 